My name is Eric Poe. I'm supposed to be looking at you, aren't I? <laughs> My name is Eric Poe. My name is Eric Poe, and uh, I'm part of the Southeastern Filmmakers. I, uh, I really got started in film after I retired from the Air Force, so that was about six and a half years ago. Anyway, since I joined Southeastern Filmmakers, um, I've, done, I've been on a lot of sets doing some grip and lighting, and uh, eventually started acting and doing some writing for screen. So that's my experience, I guess. This is only the second film that I've directed. So I, I directed a short last year, which uh, is a fan film of sorts, but it's a, uh, it's a horror uh, film called Incubation Period. Uh, I don't like uh, committing to things like this so it's it's really hard for me to make a commitment like that but this one kind of came about uh, as a as a last minute thing because there was a director um, that wasn't able to to do this project that was supposed to do this project so I was asked to step in and um, so that made it a little stressful but it wasn't too bad it, it, uh, I had a lot of help from a lot of people so favorite part really was the writing part which is really what I enjoy more than definitely more than the producing part um, when they told me the, that day before it was even announced that night I had already started thinking about um, what story I was going to tell and and kind of and not just the story I was going to tell but how to wrap up this particular story so I've been you know, I've been following Old Man of the Rooks from the beginning. I was actually an actor in Old Man of the Rooks from the beginning. And so I've seen every chapter um, probably now at least three or four or five times, maybe some of them definitely more than that. Um, but I wanted to go back through and make sure that there wasn't anything really outstanding that um, uh, needed to be tied up before we get to the final chapter. Well, certainly the production, production on any, any film. For me, it's such a stressful activity. You know, there were people that I wanted in there who were maybe available for the first couple of days and then they were out of town and wouldn't be available for, you know, for like a whole week after we had shot everything else. Again, I was lucky to have a lot of people involved who have a lot of experience and, and made it a lot easier. And most people were pretty cooperative as far as uh, actors and crew. While I was buying this shirt, I actually ran across a painting, and it was a painting, it was a print at Salvation Army of the Last Supper, and I was like, hmm, there's a, that could be, that could be really good in the one scene where I have the character of Tori, who actually gets killed in the film. So the painting is here, and she comes in, and she's eating a sandwich. And like, I'm like, it's actually like her Last Supper for real. So I'm like, I don't know if people are gonna get it, but I'm like, I'm, a, I'm putting it in there. I don't know, I, I, I don't know what I would do if I were the final director. I have not really thought about how I would wrap everything up, but um, yeah, good luck. <laughs> <laughs> Good luck and, and schedule everybody early. <laughs>